Okay, I just wanted to actually work a few of the Ohm's Law calculations for you. So on this one, we have R is 470 ohms, V equals 3.5 volts, and I is the unknown. Remember that Ohm's Law is V equals IR, or if you prefer to use the triangle circle deal. Okay, you can write it like that. So if we want to know I, if we solve this equation for I, we have to divide both sides by R. The R cancels, and we have I equals V over R. So to solve this problem, we're going to use I is equal to V over R. Both our V and our R are already in the fundamental units, so that is 3.5 volts divided by 470 ohms. And as we do that, then we'll get we get 0.00745 amps. And if we change that to engineering notation, that is going to be 7.45 milliamps. All right. So now let's look at a second problem. And this one we have the resistance is the unknown, we know the voltage, and we have I and microamps. All right. So if we want to solve for R, R is going to be um, V over I in Ohm's Law. And the problem is we have this current in microamps. Remember that that is 15.5 times 10 to the negative sixth amps. All right, and so when I plug this in to solve for R, I'm going to have 3.5 volts divided by 15.5 times 10 to the negative sixth amps. And I end up with R equal to 225,806 ohms, or we could write that as 225 kilo ohms, all right? And then finally, for the last problem, we want to know V. We have R and I, but they are not in our fundamental units, so 22 kilo ohms would be 22 times 10 to the third ohms. And 1.4 milliamps would be 0 0.0014 amps. And we need to know V then. So V is going to be equal to 22,000 ohms times 0 0.0014 amps. And when we multiply those together, we get the voltage is equal to 30.8 volts. Right. Hope that helps. Have a great day.